Right, hello, so I'm going to show you how to put a Construct 3 project onto your Android phone just for testing purposes. So the first thing to do, go over here, click on that and in the properties just check that you've got your name, description, your ID which is com dot company name dot the name of your app. So in my case it's com dot game favorites chess clock pro my author name is game favorites my email address is over here and once that's completed click on menu project export scroll down to android cordova click next you can put a tick on these boxes not too necessary i'm just going to keep it very fast and simple um, change the minify to simple click next on the android build make sure that this is changed to signed release apk scroll down and if you have already got a key just click on choose scroll down so so this is my one that i use key store it's a JKS file but if you don't have one let's just click on create and we'll just try and do this as quick as we can so Bob Clark gonna just put game company just making things up just for this purpose you'll obviously put whatever you want in there Suffolk, England, GB for Great Britain, alias, that's very important. I'm just going to keep this as um, the game company just so that it's really easy to remember. And validity, I'm just going to change that to 100 and then I don't have to worry about it expiring. Password, I'm just going to make something up real quick. And click on create. And once you've read this, just click on download key store. I'm just going to call it key store just for convenience sake. I'm going to save it into the desktop. I'll close that down, minimize this, and here it is, so keystore.jks. So keep that somewhere very safe, maybe even make a backup file for it. I'm going to close this down. Now on the signing we can now go on to choose, and if we go find that file, so it's keystore, so that's the one click open key alias so if you remember I typed in game company and the password and click on next and this can take quite a while if you selected those other options at the start, so the decouple, the duplicate images and the recompress, I think it was, it will take quite a bit longer still. So you might want to just skip ahead a little while, another maybe about a minute, I think. Okay, so we're getting somewhere, so down here at the bottom. Another bit of a wait again.
does require a little bit of patience as it's preparing. I just apologise about the weight, it's not very exciting, but at least it does show kind of what to expect, how long to wait and things. Uh, just remember to skip ahead in the, if you're watching this on a video, it's not very exciting to watch it, is it? So Ah, building Android. That's doing something. So that's that's all good. So build report four, and this is the name of my project. So we click on download. Save it wherever you want. And I'm just going to check, make sure this is on all files. I'm going to click on save. Click OK. Minimise that. So here it is. So we've got our APK file and we've got our key store. And I'll show you the next stage very shortly. Okay, so what we want to do is move this APK file onto an Android phone. I'm using a Nokia 5.1. You can use any Android phone, even a tablet if you want. First thing we do is we go into our settings. We just swipe down. We want to go under this little icon. Search in settings. We want to type in install unknown apps. So it might be under your apps and notifications special app access. Just go ahead and click on that. And there it is. You'll notice that everything says not allowed. So we go into files and we just want to go allow from this source. Yes. We come out of there now. And just want to use one of the one of these. It's a USB-C on one side, so it slots into your phone, and a USB on the other. So a pop-up comes up. Just click on OK. And I've got a SanDisk SD card in my phone. So I'll just tap on that. Now, I've already got an APK file and I want to just add another one, so I'm just going to drag and drop. Then we can close that down. And that should be on my phone now. So let's just have a little test at what it looks like. So we're going to Files and go into Apps. And I want to go on App Install Files. And this one, so open with package installer, install, install anyway, don't send, and just click on open. There we go, so let's just test it out. That's the timer. Start to start. That's all good. Try another mood. Yep, looks fine. That's how you do it.